Welcome back folks to Let's Play Killzone for the PS2. I'm Samurai TX and I'm Solid Snake. So it's come down to this. We are now on the SD platform and the Earth fleet as we are ready to take down General Adams, who is currently um, running away from us as we speak. So we're going to be ambushed by a few Hellgast after he gave his famous speech of um, that is useless to beat him and we can't change a damn thing. But yes, we can by starting by defeating him and the Hellgast. So without further ado, let's kick this guy's ass and some Hellgast. But of course, no surprise, we're going to be ambushed by a lot of Hellgast. Heard shirt. But we ambushed by a lot of Hellgasts. Gotta admit, that was one hell of a speech from a madman. But hey, I'm not scared of a madman because this madman's going to die. Just like all these Hellgasts. The birds agree. Heard shirt. Double kill. What a right time for these birds to make a cameo. I gotta admit, heard shirt. Gotta admit, these birds know how to make a cameo. Hopefully, um, they can be the um, mainstay of this video because um, the last times that these birds have been in my videos, these birds have actually been a blessing. Don't worry, I'll kill all of the Hellgasts. Oh, come on, man. See, one thing that annoys me in this game is the fact that I'm aim my crossfire is aimed at them and it doesn't do nothing. All right, can I hit? Oh, look, I hit him there. And then he hides. <laughs> <laughs> he hides after me shooting him, which is really hilarious. He's just like, ah, and then, like, um, just in frag out. Is that going to do anything? Now that I hit the wall, and now it's going to explode nowhere, unfortunately. Okay, that's fine. Can I um, hit him from here? Hi. Shut up. <laughs> there we go, he's dead. All right, what's this? No, move on. Looks like we're getting more hell gas. We're just going to activate um, the sniper. Shall we use the sniper? Or should we just keep shooting? Alright, let's just keep shooting. Oh, cool, you can shoot through this glass. Well, then again, I shouldn't really say you can shoot through that glass, because Luger did it to kill the other Hellgast before confronting Adams. So let's just use our um, gun just to uh, dispose some of these Hellgasts. I don't think that Hellgast is dead, the one that I was shooting at, but it doesn't really matter. Hello! I don't think... Okay, yeah, I did hit that one. I don't think I was hitting the other one. Frag out. Scatter! Grenade! Right, let's try and use um, let's try and use um, our gun again, the signature stealth gun, also the Stallone. I don't know which gun to use. I'm I'm kind of I'm selective on what gun I should use, but I'm gonna use Sylvester Stallone. There we go, and he's gonna die any second now. Yes, birds, I've got this. There we go. They're just putting in their word. Yep, there you go. <laughs> I've got to have the birds in my video somehow. And the funny thing is, um, normally they're in my streams too, actually. So, um, you're going to probably hear a lot of them on this Saturday because of the fact that, um, well, Saturday streams is just Birds Day as well. They like making cameos because birds, they like making a lot of noise and being vocal. They tell me off or they just, um, you know, motivate me. I think that's one way to pull it. They do motivate me, but they also lecture me. And he's dead. Did I just get a double kill? I think I did. No, I didn't. Okay, that time I killed him. It's okay, well, I got a double kill there. And now we're going to eliminate you. If you don't hide. There we go. Wait, what? There we go, you're dead. What about you? Okay, we better hide because we're going to die. Well, um, at least help me first by fending off the Hellgasts. Well, thanks for coming. Took you long enough. Because I was just a bit... God, shut up, man. It's been because um, you guys really have um, really been st um, stuck on the action for a while. Hello. Is it okay if I kill you? Or you? Or that guy? Uh, We're going to waste our last... Well, not waste. We're going to use our sniper, last sniper bullet for something worthy. And um, where shall we use it? That's a Hellgast. In his back. Ouch. That really looked painful. Right, let's collect um, our med kit and let's change our gun to this. Thank you. And now we got um, an explosive gun, which is sweet as a nut. Sweet as a nut. Technically, I could have used an uh, um, explosive to kill this um, Hellgast, but I'm going to um, use the Sylvester Stallone because I'll now get more ammo for it, so let's reload. And now we're going to work our way upstairs. And there ain't no ammo for us down here, unfortunately, so let's go upstairs. Finally, we've secured this area. Oh look, there's a health med kit there, and there's some more Hellgasts. 
not surprised. So General Adams must not be too far, because he can't have ran away too far. He must be just leaving his Helgast army for us. And of course, these guys just sponge a lot, because, like, look what I'm shooting them with, and then, uh, Rico, why are you in the way? But anyway, never mind. Let's switch guns. I'm going to use this, shall I? Yeah, I'll use this for now. I'm pretty sure, yeah, this this standard uh, ISA rifle is pretty good, actually, against some um, Helgasts. It depends on what area you shoot them in. Alright, he ran forward. General Adams must just be in that room over there, because um, they're just all coming out of that room, which is pretty um, amusing. Right, we just got to keep blowing them up now. Uh, or we could just shoot them. My choice of words. Um, I think I'll do both, because I do have the explosive gun. Oh, hello. Right, let's just shoot you with this normal, with the um, standard ISA gun. Okay, we're running out of bullets. There we go. And now we are going to kill some more. If he doesn't run away. Um, let's see. Hello? Are you there, sir? Hello? Hmm, cheeky bugger. He's found his hiding place. There's no point in hiding. You know, let me try and blow you up. Oh, look, he came out of his hiding place just as I say, let me try and blow you up. That's pretty funny. Oh, shut up about die. How about you die for a change? And that's General Adams yelling, kill them, so... Yeah, he's definitely nearby. But well, where is he? General Adams! Oh, look, Medkit. General Adams, I'm coming for you! Oh, hello. Wait, he sponged that. He's alive. Now he's dead. Okay, something's... Some, I think that was just some wind. I don't know where the wind is. Fire? Okay, General Adams must be somewhere around there. Hello? Hello? Oh, Hellgast. Ouch, that hurts. Oh! Stop sponging, man. What is wrong with these Hellgasts? Alright, we're just gonna... Oh, God! Oh, God! Ow, 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 Okay, I think General Adams is in that room. Let's collect the medkit. Uh, there ain't no med kit around here. I thought there was a med kit here, unless I already picked it up by mistake. I think I did. Yep, I did pick it up by mistake. Ah oh, well. Right, so we're gonna have to think carefully when it comes to this part, because there's General Adams in there, because clearly he was firing and killing me. And then there's um, the Hellgast over here, who should be easy to kill. And I think he is dead. Right, I think that's General Adams yelling now, so, um, oh, there's a... They kill you? Come on, just die, please. Like, he stopped... Oh, there's two of them. Help you? <laughs> now you want help? Well, General Adams, you can screw you. Screw you. I was about to say you can go screw yourself. Either way, you knew where I was going with that um, verbal abuse towards General Adams. You are a backstabber. Why do you need help? And you die, deservedly so. Is there any medkits? Can I use or drop any medkits? Can I have some medkits, please? Where is he? Ah, there you are, General Adams. Oh, look, medkit there. I'm going to have to run. I'm going to have to quickly run in there and um, quickly get it. Or well, I could just blow him up. Okay, that hurt him. I can hear him go. Oh! Okay, that did not hurt him. That hurt me more. Right, let's collect the med kit. Oh, full health. Nice. Right, he's, he's hiding there. I can tell because I saw his gun. Now he's shooting at us. Okay, this is going to be a bit of a fight. Hi! Let's just shoot him in the head or shoot him in the body. Wherever I shoot him, he's going to die regardless. Then he's going to sponge like no uh, one's um, like no one's home, you know. I don't know where I was going with that either. Even the birds found it lame. I could shoot you like this. Hi! <laughs> and he's dead. General Adams is officially dead. And now the Hellgast are just targeting. Wait, where are we going? Where am I going? Oh, we're going this way. All right, let's quickly go. Hacker's been shot. All right, Hellgast. You've had your time. Just die. Thank you. Hacker, we're just going to follow you. You're just standing there now. All right, let's keep following Templar. Yeah, I'm just going to follow Templar. But this mission is complete. We've killed Adams and we saved the world. Cutscene time now.
fuel line obstructed. We got a problem with the fuel line. I got it. And what do you know about the spec of these craft? Coming back. Get through to them and see what the situation is. And tell them about Adams. First kill I make. Looks like most of the Earth fleet got through okay. They'll send more forces, won't they? The hold on to me. Yeah, they will. We'll be there to meet them. And that's it, folks. Um, Luger. Um, time is 1 8 minutes 51 seconds, 580 shots fired, 90 kills, 5 headshots, 33% hit efficiency. Well, I did use the Sylvester Stallone quite a bit, but yeah, as you can see, there ain't no quit. So that's it for Killzone, everybody. We have defeated the game, and now it's going to go to the credits since we've beaten the game. What can I say about this first entry in the Killzone series? I liked it. Was it the Halo Killer? Of course it wasn't. We all knew it was never going to kill Halo the moment it was released, but we all knew we were going to enjoy it because it had um, content for us to um, enjoy from the campaign to the battlefield mode, which you can play either by yourself or with friends and AI, of course. So yeah, this game will definitely have packed content ahead of its time. Oh, and it had net play if you actually used um, Ethernet connection, which I did not. But yes, you could play online in this game and... Well, obviously, online in the PS2 days were terrible, so it was best that you didn't play online. <laughs> but, um, yeah, this game definitely had a lot coming for it. And, um, of course, there's Killzone 2, the sequel. And um, we will be playing that, just not this year. We'll be playing it probably around next year. Who knows? But um, I'm excited to be playing Killzone 2. I will play the Killzone Trilogy because I really did enjoy the first three entries of this franchise. This is just the beginning to be honest with you, and yes, there will be more Hellgas coming for us, considering what we did. We are going, it looks like we're going to be staying on planet Vecca, because we would know the Hellgas will be coming, and obviously Templars will be waiting for them, so, yeah, it looks like this where we'll be staying is planet Vetka, because um, obviously, um, as you could tell, when we was escaping, there was more Hellgas, so, yeah, they know of us, and they know of our presence, and they know we've got away, we've killed um, General Lente and General Adams, so, yeah, this is only the beginning of a war between the ISA and the Helga, so yeah, I'll be joining that for sure by playing Killzone 2 whenever I'm ready. But yeah, if I have to be honest, um, for me this game does get a 7 out of 10, it is a solid entry to the series, but um, there is a lot of flaws in this game, like the AI is stupid, there's a bit of glitches and whatnot, but for a first entry in the series, of course there will be... Um, glitches and whatnot there will be um flaw lots of flaws but um for the story and the campaign and for the challenge yeah i'm gonna give it um a seven out of ten a solid seven well six and seven but mostly um in my view i'll give it a seven out of ten 
because there is still a lot of flaws in the first entry of this series. But um, it's um, for the uh, content that it has, it definitely bumps up its rating much more. If it didn't have a lot of content, then I probably would have lowered the score to a 6 to 5 out of 10. But before, because of the fact that it has um, the multiplayer aspect, the battlefield aspect, where you can play by yourself or friends and net play, the fact that it added all of that in its um, thing, um, in its um, game, sorry, not thing, in its game, it does deserve a 7 out of 10 just for it. But yeah, that's it for um, the campaign mode of Killzone. And um, once you beat it, it just goes back to the menu and you've unlocked cutscenes and whatnot. But um, it gives you your stats as well. Plus, um, I've played this game um, already, so my stats will be there. But I'm going to show them anyway, because why not? So, um, obviously, you go back to the menu after beating every game. Let's go to the extras. You get war scenes, game intro, cutscenes and whatnot. And um, let's go to the campaign and it shows you your stats. Let's um, press, it's, I think it's modify. And there's your statistics. As you can see, it took me 12, well, it's 12 hours I played the campaign. Levels played, 129. Levels 159. Kills, 2,471. Headshots, 715. Deaths, 41. Yeah, I've died a few times because I played on hard difficulty in the thing. And Battlefield, I'm yet to play. But, um, you know, maybe I will do a video where I will play the Battlefield mode in this game. But for now, um... What can I say about this game uh, that I already haven't, apart from that it's a solid campaign, it, um, it is a challenge because the fact that um, the Helgars do sponge, but um, apart from that you will enjoy this campaign and you will enjoy the first entry to the Killzone series and the other two games that it has, um, because um, if I remember correctly Killzone 3 also has co-op. So yeah, they definitely stepped up their game in terms of um, the way that they presented it, but um, I think I'm done rambling about this game because um, I've beaten it and um, I've reviewed it within um, two to three minutes and um, I'm looking forward to my next Let's Play because um, obviously I've got Advance Wars continuing still because I just started that recently. But for Killzone, it's going to be um, a break from first person shooters and jump onto a different genre. A genre which I do enjoy, i got to say, but um, I will leave that till Tuesday. Anyway, this is Samurai TX signing out for this Let's Play. This is Solid Snake, signing out for this Let's Play. Until then, until then, thank you guys for watching, and we shall see you guys in the next Let's Play. Take care, everybody. Later! Thanks for watching this Let's Play. Take care.